Good morning, Brookwood Beavers. This is Sam and Adam reporting live from the Brookwood Broadcasting Center. Today is Monday, the 28th, 2019. The weather today is cloudy, rainy, and cold. Lunch for today is choice of French toast sticks and sausage, cheese quesadilla, PB&J sandwich with cheese and crackers, yogurt with cheese stick and crackers, served with oven potatoes, cinnamon apples, green leaf lettuce, fresh baby carrots, chilled peaches, chilled fruit cocktail. There are no birthdays for today, but over the weekend we had Lily Fleming. And now for Mr. Brick. All right. Hey, happy Monday, everybody. Hope you had a wonderful weekend. Um, first off, yesterday we had a beautiful day for Trunk or Treat. I uh, wanted to thank Mrs. Wilson, Mrs. McKinney, Mrs. Langerud, Mrs. Huck, Mrs. Ag, and Mrs. Grogan for coming out yesterday and having a great trunk for all the kids to, uh, get to play in and get candy. I'm sure many of you went home yesterday with some extra candy. Uh, and hopefully, the weather starts to improve this week so that you can actually get out on Thursday night and go trick or treating. But it's looking a little ominous with the weather. With cold, rainy, snowy, whatever it might be Thursday. Uh, it's already gotten really chilly this week. So quick reminder to you guys, as you guys are getting your winter coats out, take a second and just write your name on the back tag uh, or somewhere in there so that if we find your jacket, uh, we're able to get it back to you. I'm hoping that the lost and found has not become overfilled with jackets and pullovers this winter, that you guys actually can keep track of all your stuff. But um, I know it happens from time to time, but just put your name in there so that way if it does get turned into lost and found, we can get it to you quickly. First and last name helps us out quite a bit. Because um, here's the deal, Mrs. Langerud, who is our official meteorologist for Brookwood Elementary, I didn't know if you knew that, but she is, is predicting three to four inches for Thursday. Wednesday night to Thursday, she's predicting three to four inches with a layer of ice and snow on top of it. So if that does not happen, we're gonna have to question Mrs. Langerud's credibilities in terms of being a meteorologist. But right now, she is predicting that. So bundle up this week. Um, I think that's all I've got, because as they go over stuff, I'll chime in. So I'm gonna turn it back over to Sam and Adam, and then we'll, we'll keep going. Okay, today is an A day. Um, we have no announcements for today, <clears throat> and upcoming events are Beaver Lodges tomorrow at 8.30. Yep. South Area Choral and Orchestra Wednesday. Oh, and, well, Choral's uh, Tuesday, Orchestra's Wednesday. And you guys each will have a practice in the morning. So Choral Kiddos, you'll go tomorrow morning, and then Orchestra Kiddos, you'll go on Wednesday to practice. And then we'll have our performance at 7 o'clock that night. And on Thursday, we have our Halloween parade slash party. Okay. Interesting fact for me today. So I want to give... Shout out to the two local schools, uh, KU and K-State. KU had a thrilling come from behind victory. I have never seen a block kick return back to a fumble to where you get to kick again and win the game. So congratulations to the Jayhawks, that was an impressive game. And then congratulations to the Kansas State Wildcats with a thrilling victory over the mighty Oklahoma Sooners. What do you think about that, Adam? Uh, it was a good one. It was a good, yeah, it was a good game. See, KU and K-State games can come together and just appreciate each other's games. Uh, but good weekend for the local schools and Chiefs. Not doing too well. <sighs> All right, but here's the deal. We're missing the homes. We had our left guards out, Fisher, Chris Jones, Frank Clark. We're missing a lot of stars, and we still played well last night, but that fourth and three, you gotta go for it. End of the game. You gotta go for it. Can't play the ball. But that's just me venting a little bit. But other than that, good weekend, fun weekend. Guys, anything else we're missing? Um no. All right, take it away then. Please give your teacher for please and please give your teacher your attendance. <laughs> it's Monday, that's all right. Please give your teacher your attention for the Pledge of Allegiance and have a great day. We did it.